Today in the Whitefish Range, we saw the classic signs of a wind slab avalanche problem, though on this terrain the hazard was small. Among the signs, drifts on the lee sides of trees, scalloped snow surfaces, blowing snow, and fresh cornices. These were sensitive to a person's weight, though the debris didn't trigger slabs on the slopes below. I was able to trigger one small slab, 4 to 12 inches thick, on a well-supported slope, so it didn't run far. Look for signs like these when a wind slab avalanche problem is listed in the forecast. You can get forecasts at flatheadavalanche.org.